Hey guys, Mitch here. Today we have a speed test comparison comparing the iPhone 5S to the iPhone 5C and to the iPhone 5. So all three iPhones uh, from the 5 all the way up to the 5S. So if you're wondering which iPhone 5 you should get, whether it's the S, the C, or the original, this speed test video will break it down. Now both the iPhone 5S and the 5C are running iOS 7 and then the iPhone 5 is running iOS 6.1. So we're gonna go ahead here and run the bench test or the benchmark and you should see the iPhone 5 comes in first with a single core of 1404 and dual 2507, the 5C 712, 1284 and the iPhone 5 on the right 723 to with the single core and dual core is 12 96. So first with the iPhone 5C, a 1284 dual core running iOS 7 is not bad. Um, compared to that with the iPhone 5S, a 2500 for the dual core. So pretty much twice as fast as the iPhone 5C and the iPhone 5 coming in with 1296. So the iPhone 5C and 5S are comparable as the iPhone 5S stacks above. So now we're going to go ahead here and do and turn off turn off all three devices and see which one will power down uh, the fastest. Pretty much all of them will turn down at the same exact time, the iPhone 5S lagging a little bit behind. And then we're going to go ahead here and turn them on. So we'll first start off with the iPhone 5C and then we'll move over to the center for the 5S, followed by the iPhone 5 on the right hand side. And after about a few seconds, I've sped this up, you should see the iPhone 5C comes on, then the iPhone 5S. And last but not least is the iPhone 5, which will lag behind a little bit. Now, all these tests, like I said, have been sped up, but the iPhone 5S in all will overtower compared that to the iPhone 5C or the iPhone 5, mainly because it's chip, well, it's running a faster chip than the iPhone 5 and the 5C, which are running the same chip inside their components. So with our Geekbench test and the startup and the uh, power down times, I hope this speed test does do it justice.